benefits include diet, sleep, and exercise. Exercise includes the physical, the mental, and the spiritual. Today we're going to do an exercise routine to get you to perform physically for the day. Exercise takes discipline. In training, training and discipline require routines. Routines involve movement of exercise, that means for you, an end, a lot of practicing, which is fun. I've been certified since 1991 with AFA, American Fitness Federation of America, and I've had several jobs since the 90s, Body Quest with Joyce, Slab It, New Outlook, YMCA in Haverhill, the Greek Orthodox Church, World's Gym, Gold's Gym, I've done dance for the Greek school, a Haverhill, I've run eight marathons since 2013 up until 2021 in October, and I've also done classes at Kripalu in the Berkshires. So I've practiced a lot on exercising, and I enjoy it, and I want to share this video, and I want to introduce my friend and neighbor, Deb Whitty. Hi, Deb. Hello. So, we're going to do the routine. It's a 12-minute routine, so let's begin. We're going to start with the sun and the moon posture. And it's really simple. And after doing the routine, you'll start to get to know the movements. So here we go. Lift your arms up over your head and grab your wrist to one side. Alternate with the other hand, and then we're just going to slightly lift our heads up and drop down and grab our elbows. And we're just going to hang here for a second, and we're going to reach for the ground, and with our right leg, kick it out, and do a plank down to the ground, and just relax for a second. You can also lift your legs up and flex. That always feels good. Even rotate back down. We're gonna lift up. And now we're gonna stand on our arms. And we're just gonna naturally look straight ahead from this position and bring it back down. Now we're gonna do the triangle. We're gonna get on our tiptoes and we're gonna go up and triangle. And we're going to bring our heels down as comfortable. Bending the knees also feels good. And what I like to do is also lift my legs up a little bit and bend the knees. And we went out with our right, so we're going to come and stand up with our left. Bring it in and up. Now we're going to do the other side. Lift it up and over and over and slip back and we're going to grab our elbows. We're just going to hang here a little bit, bend our knees and touch the ground and we're going to lower ourselves, oop, nope, with the opposite leg of mine. I'm going to do the left side this time because I already did the right side. So I'm gonna go with my left and come down and relax. And you can lift your legs up a little bit and flex and drop. And now we're gonna get up to the triangular again. And just go back. You wanna tiptoe it a little bit, that feels good. Kinda go back and forth. That feels really good. And because I started off with my left, now I'm going to bring my right in. It's important to balance the movements on both sides. It matters. And how does that feel, Deb? Really good. It's in. I'm woken up. I'm ready. That's great. Now, the next set of exercises, I've done a lot of research on what matter to people and what matter to people is having a strong back and a strong abdomen 
especially in the lower part where we get older and control becomes, uh, you know, a little bit harder too. So these next exercises are going to help more bladder control and build your stomach. Here we go. Very, very easy. We're going to put one hand behind your head for balance on the hip or on the leg. And we're going to raise one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Now we're going to do the other side. Back and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Now what we're going to do is we're going to do the chest compressions. This is easy, very, an old timer when it comes to chest and abdomen workout. So we're going to go one with our elbows and hands, two, three, four, five, six, to this little abdominal routine is we're going to alternate and the lunges backwards and we're going to go up from the top and pull down and we're going to go one two three four five six Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and and on the left, which makes twelve. So that was it. Great workout for the lower stomach for a lot of control and posture too. You'll find your posture is a little bit better just from doing these three routines. You know, this one routine of three exercises. So what we're going to do now is we're going to do some calisthenics on the ground. So Debbie, I'm going to start here. And what we're going to do is we're going to go on one side. And I really like to use my arm as a pillow and use my front arm as a support and kick the leg out on the bottom in the back. And we're gonna do leg lifts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Now we're gonna bring it down and bend that leg back, and we're gonna lift again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Now what we're going to do is we're going to kick it out and up, and one, and two, and three, it's right. And four. 
and five and six oops and seven and eight I'm doing it differently from my other one yesterday and nine and 10. Somewhere around 11 and one more dip. Oh my God. And now because we're like this, this is the cruncher. Oh yes. We go down and up. This part I'm Two. gonna have to sit out on. Okay, three, four, five, Six. I always feel like I'm sewing when I do this one, like I'm making a little stitch. A nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and down. Okay, now we're gonna flip it over. I remember teaching calisthenics at Body Quest at Joyce's, you know, being like 19 years old doing these exercises. That's how long I've been doing these exercises. So let me see if I can remember how I did it yesterday because I did it a little easier. Let me see. Okay. We're going to put the back leg down. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, and we're going to bend it now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and I think I went 1, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I also work at Heavenly Donuts. I lift those buckets up and down the stairs. It's probably because of that. Two. So now what we're going to do, this last exercise, it's always a killer. One, two, <laughs> three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Phew. All right. So, that feels really good, and that's not bad though, right? 12 minutes. Thanks for joining us on Healthy Habits with Deb's permission. I might put it on my YouTube station. Okay. Maybe cut All right. the part out in the middle where I okay. struggled a bit. Thank you for joining Healthy Habits.